Good afternoon, everybody. I hope everyone's doing really well. Uh, since last time I streamed, I got two people to thank. Is this folks? So I gotta thank uh, Frank, uh, Tintin and Darklight for the follow. And other than that, uh, we're going to get started. So I wonder how everyone's doing well today. You make a brand new game. I think it just completely deletes the profile. Oh well. I did have a huge amount of progress on the previous game, but uh, that can be fixed. Alright, let's clean up a little bit. Man, I got like no tools. This is so bad. Oh well. Let's just clean up a little bit here. And then let's get some tools. I guess that's why he was an X, because if he wasn't an X, he wouldn't be cutting through his steel pipes. Mm. I love the chill atmosphere that this game has. Okay, we can clean. Let me check something really quick. Come on. Uh, wrong one. The gameplay. Yeah, there we go. How did they... This is more than just stealing a radiator. And let me just throw that over there. Yeah, that whole section should be replaced. But they didn't pay me to replace that, so... They get what they pay for. All these random phone calls today. Alright, let's just clean this up and make it look a lot less nasty. Hmm. Alright, we got perk. We can either do faster cleaning, barrel range. Uh. I'd rather get the extra dirt version. small house so not much to say but hmm. let's throw that here e store well first of all task gun Alright. 
And uh, okay, we didn't get that much money, but it's a start. I do love that you can see all the work you did, but on the first couple of stages, you really don't do that much. Okay, and it's lagging. Okay, let's start uh, cleaning up a little bit around here. I would rather not live in a pigsty. Not much I can do to help it though, considering this is just... How did they do this? Once I want to sell this house and get something better, but oh, well. I'm we have way too little money. Cleaning the garage. Just could do the missions in order from top to bottom, whatever that order is. Let's get him out of the way for a little bit. You can tell which ones are trash and which ones are not by seeing if they have the white outline or not. White outlines are trash. The blue ones are not trash. Got a skill point. I'd rather be able to see all of the dirt. That way, if I do miss sign, it's easier to get. Faster cleaning doesn't help that much. The mops are really good, though. I love how the only dirty spot is the garage. You think a lot more would be dirty if this was actually dirty.
There we go, that's everything. That job was almost worthless. But a little bit of cleaning can go a long way towards improving the appearance of an area. And I got something in my eye. Alright, this is easy. Just assemble these up. Mm. A lot of these early missions don't have much going for it. They're just there to get you some starting capital and use to the gameplay mechanic. The Tyler is way more useful, although we're probably not going to get to it for a little bit. Okay, this one goes... Okay, I have to mop that up. If you click too fast, and that can be problematic. saying that's at least somewhat nice. Finish the job if we want. Yeah, nice and chill. This is probably one of the easiest ways to make decent money. For the time you actually put in, you get a pretty good reward on some of these early missions. Ah. I love how just tapping wrong you get a spill. <laughs> there we go, that mission's finished. 897 dollars, that's not too bad. Mm-hmm. 
They have gravel in a couple bushes. Gardening in this game is so much fun. So we got a hose. Yeah, gardening can be a lot of fun. So they want remove weeds. They want scare gar garden and one plant. Okay, let's do that. So I think the red one looks the best. Only charges you for the area that you cover, nothing else. So it's, you don't have to be pixel perfect. So I do want to get a little bit more. There we go. Then this one's uh. I think this one will look the best. Shell speed is probably the biggest upgrade you can get. Hmm. This one's done. Gravel down. Then let's take these weeds out. Mm. Uh, one second. Sorry about that. Just a family distraction. get to a point where I can make my own uh, or build my own houses though because that's really where the game really comes alive this one they want two color
I hate that when you're on the borderline, it won't tell you all of the gold. You gotta be like this close. Alright, let's weed it. Yeah, this is just an entry level gardening, teaching you how to do basic gardening. Nothing too crazy. But this one, a square one would be nice contrast. Let's throw that one down there. Contrasting shapes is a great way to get more value out of your plants. Technically, I could finish this mission, but I'm not going to. They want a uh, single color gravel. This probably isn't that expensive. Ah. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Do they want one more Confucius straw? Actually, I can change up a little bit more by using a narrow cut like this. But, ah. Probably the best thing we could do. I use one cube. I could use another cube duplicate. Or we could do a three layer. Yeah, let's do that. So I hope everyone's having a great day. I'm a little bit under the weather, but I'm all right. Just decided to relax, take it easy, and actually play through this game again. I haven't touched this in a while, seriously, but I love its relaxing attitude. So just take a look. So you got two different colors, a warm and cold color. You got shapes that are different in each area. It makes it pop, and then when you're looking from here, you can see Every single shrub that matters. This one I'd probably move a little bit further out. This one's fine where it is. But I think this overall blends well with what they were going for. And should be easier to maintain as well. It definitely feels a lot more kept... It has a little bit more composure. Alright. Alright. They want us to start painting. So they don't want us to mess with this room. They want us to repair the electrical outlet, which is here. Okay, that's why. So we want mm. 
screw it up nice and tight and we'll be set. That one's fixed. This is the one they want us to... Well, let's start off with the repair first. Here we go. Take on fix. Mm. Let's get this back here. One little trick is you buy a large and then sell whatever you don't use. Also, when you first get started, I really do like this color. This is a good color. There we go. That's gonna save my sanity and a lot of money. The paint efficiency is gonna save you the most amount of money. While uh, the paint painting speed helps a lot. I don't know why you'd want to dual color it. We could probably split it here though and switch to gray on the other side. I just don't think that would work as well for them. I think this event, this color is so much better for what they want to do. Something's just slowing me down today. We 
can literally watch the dollars and cents go up as I keep working on these walls. Each wall panel is worth like 10 bucks. Or every couple. Hum, 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 hum. Save a little bit on paint. There we go. There we go. And all the money we want. Dun 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 dun. Dun dun dun. Dun 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 dun. Alright, let's get the next project going, baby on the way. Okay, they want a room cleaned up for a baby. Easy enough to do. Okay, who the heck left this house like this? This is appalling. Like, seriously? You guys bought this pigsty? How are you guys gonna live with yourself? Ay, ay, ay. Let's clean this up. Man, 
man, this is so nasty. Why do you have it like this? Where the heck is this one? I got it, so. Alright. That's clear. Honestly, they should unify the paint or clean it up a bit more but what do I know it's not like they paid me to make this place more suitable for the child the last window okay This room's good and ready, so let's leave the windows open, let it freshen up. Clean along here, get this nice and clean. That's clean. You want a child to live in this room? When some people okay, they want a uh, pastel pink on this room. Uh, okay, let's clean this up first and paint it.
Come on, get this stuff out of the way. Oh, I see it down. That's clean, so it's just the windows and that should be everything. Then just paint it pink and that should be fine. Hmm. Oh, I should probably do the painting now. Okay, there's one more. What the heck? There we go. Okay, let's start painting. Dun dun dun.
Sorry about that. I need to respond to some important texts. All right, let's wrap this up. You gotta do a large amount of wall tiles to get all the paint upgraded. Anyway, so they want a... Excuse me about that. There we go. Cherry, this will pop with the room. Go with some green one. There we go. This room's good. All right, let's clean this up. All right, let's, we got two more rooms to do. Hey, Palm, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? That's fine. You can be as late as you want. Not feeling great today. This is House Flipper. It's a game about home renovation and improvements. Right now, I'm just doing contracts to build up some money. But, uh, basically... 
Outside of contracts, you can actually own your own apartments or own your own buildings and sell them for big money. But you also have to buy them, so it's definitely a bit more expensive. So right now we're just cleaning up this place. The story in this one is that the, I don't even know what they did, but they're apparently having a baby and they need it cleaned up. So it's good for the baby. And I legit don't get how they could have let this place get so bad. Okay, that's all cleaned up. The window and this one's done. There's a lot more you can do though. Like you can actually take and add or remove walls. You can do a whole lot of adding items. You can get a feel for what's going on when I finish this mission right now. That whole mission was only seven grand. That, but yeah, like you clean up the place, you repaint it. Yeah, it's not a super exciting game. There's nobody to kill or arrest in this game. There's nobody voting. There's more than just cleaning up. You can basically make stuff however you want. It's definitely though. Yeah. Right now we're just doing all the early game contracts. So they want, uh, so this one, they want a change up of the gardens. The gardening part is really cool. I really like the gardening, but it's definitely a little bit more limiting what you're doing. So, do, do, do. So they want to sell these and they want grass. Okay. Let's see. Large should fit. No, large won't fit. So medium. It's not going to be perfect, but it'll get most of it. Hmm. I mean, installing grass is actually a little harder than you'd think. Actually, I would like it. Ah. Small should be good enough. You only charge for the grass that wasn't there when you started. <laughs> So, this one, they want us to sell these dead ones. So they want mode. I love how they give us the worst tool for the job. Technically, that's all I need to do to win the mission. I could end the mission right now. You actually get a mower in a little bit, and the mower is so much better. Like, I'm only an hour into the game. I, to be fair, nothing saying really has happened, but... <laughs> There's a lot of content, so... Uh, ah. I'm going to do... Oh, no, that's too big. Shoot. I can do this one. So... Yep. And then we do one more. Okay, let's get maximum payment. See all the dirt. And then... Let's go for large to wrap this up.
So there we go. This line is done. I'll go that way in a bit. Let's cut this down. You sell them to the uh, biogas company, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. In depending on where you are in the United States, there are various uh, ways. Uh, there are companies that will uh, mulch or compost uh, the waste for you. You just gotta either order them, or sometimes villages will provide a service. Other times you have to compost it yourself or it goes into a normal garbage stream. But usually if you can, you want to compost. Because composting is the more environmentally friendly way to get rid of uh, trimmings and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Thankfully, this is one of the only missions you have to mow with this piece of junk. Mm. Okay, that's about 60%, so it's 40% more. Probably on the other side. Mm. But I do like the gardening. Oh! I ain't gonna spoil anything, but fire, fire eventually is an option. You just gotta get to the end of the campaign. <laughs> it's also way, way more expensive. I'm not. Let's see what does. Yeah, you know let's get a slightly better version because why not? None of the gardening upgrades really matter. <laughs> mm. Yeah, that's definitely a lot better. There we go, 100% done. They didn't give us that much money, but we also didn't spend that much time on it. Mm. Yeah, one grand for that. Taking out some bushes, uh, covering some grass, and then mowing the yard. That was with level 3 negotiation. That's 50% more. Like, That's not a lot of money. So, just to show you what you can do though, at some point, you can actually go to the browser. All these houses, you can buy any of them you want. You can buy them and you can renovate them and then sell them. And that's where the real fun is. Of course, you need an insane amount of money, but... <laughs> yes, you can buy a moon. But don't tell Elon Musk, he still doesn't know that. <laughs> so yeah. That's something you can do. But as I said before, I need a lot more money. I don't even have that much. Like, I'd want 100000 to work with just to work on a 60k property. Or at least 80k if I want to do a 30k property. Does that kind of make sense? Oh, this is awesome. We finally get it. I remember the combo. Yeah, 
Maybe that's an upgrade. But this is so much faster. That might be the upgrade. <laughs> but yeah, there is a lot of work that goes into uh, making a good property. And landscaping is probably the best aspect this game has. Although it's a little gimmicky how the scoring works on it. But you can do a lot of very cool things artistically. The game also has day and night cycles too, so you get real time lighting changes. Although it only will generate lighting from a single room, which sucks. Mm. Also I love how you can basically go through trees. It keeps you from getting stuck in. Also be glad you don't have a cor- I don't know if you've ever had a corner slot. Corner slots are the worst because you got two different lawns to worry about. Or two different angle lawns along the street. And then you get one that's in the backyard that's annoying. So, well, it depends on how your yards are configured. but. Basically, I live on a corner. Because I live on the corner, I have uh, two front yards. One facing the front of the house and one facing the side of the house along the street. That's a lot of extra mowing to do. Most people only have their front yard and their backyard. Does that make more sense? I do apologize if I'm not as talkative as I usually am. I don't know what the heck I have, but I got something. I know I'm lucky I have a yard, but it's also... I really don't want a yard, considering I don't care to take care of it. I'm not a yard person. And my parents are getting old and they can't really handle it. So it's... the case of have but do not want it's why a lot of older people will get an apartment or a townhouse because someone else takes care of that shit <laughs> by the way just a pro tip do not intentionally drive a lawnmower over gravel while the blades are running you will probably shoot your eye out or shoot somebody's eye out. <laughs> mm. Mm. Yeah, as much as I love Untrusted, I do want to play of more varieties of games. Even though I don't get as many viewers playing other games. I don't want to just be the untrusted guy, you know? And untrusted is not going to be here forever, so... Mm -hmm. Alright. That should be the entirety of the yard. Okay, let's see what we have for perks. There we go. So we have all the mowing done. So they want a sun launcher and a swing pool and mow line. Okay. 
so you can in a general sense refer to a garden or a yard as the same thing however depending on the context there are some distinctions gardens more specifically refer to areas where it's not just grass but also things like flowers or trees or a combination of various organic plant life with the intent to be decorative while as a yard generally refers to a lawn the area that you can lounge in or have activities like a grilling or things along those lines it's a very critical distinction and in a lot of more native conversations there will be a difference in how you use them but most of the time you can use them interchangeably hmm <laughs> it's gonna be nicer when it's actually in the ground, but it's also not mine, so. <laughs> the problem with pools is they take a lot of maintenance. The problem with everything that's fun or cool is that they require a lot of maintenance. <laughs> like, you gotta clean them out, otherwise, they get pond scum and other things. You need to, um,. Okay, now let's add some loungers. To go against the blue, let's buy some red ones. And then, I'll be honest, I think they should have a table as well. Let's go do... Uh... uh Let's go for this one. No, that's way too tall. Wrong color. Now this one. And with a dark cherry. Oh yeah. Look at this. Does that not look a little bit better? I'd probably get something with an umbrella, but at this uh, Technically, we can go through and see what their house looks on the ins- Uh, never mind. No, they won't let- or I think they blocked this one off, but we'll see. Will they actually let us in? Nope, they disabled access on this house. Okay. Either way, that's nearly nine grand for just mowing the yard and putting a pool in. <laughs> But yeah, we did have to put some money because we had to buy everything that we installed, but hey, we got a free molar out of it. Houses are expensive in the U.S. The area I live, my house isn't that great, but the land value alone is at least a quarter of a million dollars right now, and that's due to the inflated housing market prices and the really expensive houses in the area. That's just for the land. The house itself is probably a hundred grand on top of that. We could probably push it to uh, 400,000 to 500,000 if we really wanted, but we're not doing. That being said, the value of property can flip flop a lot depending on what people want. If we have a substantial recession, that can be a problem. Okay, so first things first. Let me just check. So what tasks they want. So they don't want me to cut down trees here, here. But here they want me to cut one down.
the tighter it is to a city. Did you ever read The Giving Tree? You can be sad about the tree all you want, but you should always be happy that the tree was able to accomplish their dreams. And that's one person who will never hire me again. <laughs> The funny part about that response is you could be taken in three different ways of context. Oh, they want a pool as well? Or a pond. Given this environment, let's go for a uh, brown, a uh, bread. Oblong means it's a irregular shape that's circular in nature. So think of a circle that's slightly deformed. That's the best way to think of oblong. And then... Uh, it's a pond. So ponds are like... And then... A man-made, a, a pond can either be man-made or not, but it's basically a small basin of water that's not like a pool that you're trying to swim into, but rather is used for either the, the water effects or for keeping various animals in. You can sometimes fish at ponds, whereas you wouldn't fish at a pool. Does that make more sense? Personally, I would do a lot more than just put the pond in. I would add some flowers around it or some decorations. But they're not paying me for that, so I'm not going to put the effort in. <laughs> okay, so they want some additional walls. This is the first... Um, one where you can actually start building walls. Okay, first things first, they want some fixing. This is what we like to call a handyman. Because they have so many hands in every little pot. In this game, you can. Technically, for things like this, you can do that without being a certified electrician, but... There are certain things you need a certified electrician for. Yep. Handyman, in this situation, our role would be either a handyman, a contractor, since technically we're doing contracts, 
Um, renovator. Home designer. There's a lot of little hats we could claim. Oh, we go destroy some walls too. This is a part of the game where it really gets fun. <laughs> yeah. Home designers have some control over electricity, but they don't directly impact it, but they can come up with ideas and run by electricians and then have someone more qualified actually implement them. Yeah, this is probably one of the more fun parts of the game. Just breaking down walls. Mm. Oops. <laughs> that was... <laughs> Your timing's almost perfect. I... I didn't even know you could do that. <laughs> there we go. Now they want a new wall. Oh. Uh... That perfectly good wall, I bet I now take it down real quick. Okay. Actually, there's one very scary perk where you can build up to four walls at a time. Like, as you can see how it glitches around a bit. <laughs> Alright, before this gets too difficult. Oh, we got a new skill point. I will fix that light or I'll add I'll add that light back to make up for it. I'm not a jerk. Give me a light, not nah, ah. The search engine's so garbage at times. All right, let's go. It's thinking of the idea of light as in light color. Uh, where is the freaking squ- Uh, am I going insane? So let's just sort by ceiling, ceiling, ceiling. Uh, oh, there it is. I'm blind. <laughs> There we go. Also, they want a cot.
Oh, they want me to sell this. Since we did that, we can do this. We can do... There we go. That should be a lot nicer. And then this one. Oh, that's all task completed. They don't even want me to paint the brick wall I built. <laughs> Yeah, they didn't want, you know, paint the place. Whew. Either way, I was able to... A lot of these missions are really quick. I don't know why you want the quick jobs at all. They make no sense. This is a scary one to get because it allows you to build way too fast. Faster building is probably the best one. Faster demolition. Okay. That's the perk sorted. Now, let's knock down some walls. Okay. Hmm. And then you want... Let's just start pushing. You will not be nice. Why won't it let me... I'm gonna be taking this wall out anyway. Why won't you let me sell it? This game is sometimes a little dumb. I do actually have Thief Simulator. I'm bad at it though. Yeah, the wall never did anything to us, but it's gotta go because they're paying us to remove it. I love how we're keeping all the furniture there too. they painted all of this, so that's a lot of extra money that they're wasting on the paint. all cleaned out. Okay. 
Oh, and they want this painted. Okay. Let's get to painting. I love how the whole... Yeah, this game doesn't care about load-bearing walls. In this game, you can literally take out every single wall in the house and it won't fall down. Except for the outside walls. So I got a question for you. How often have you ridden the trains in France? Or do you mostly take your car around? Do you take a car or do you take uh, trains when you're going around? You've never taken a train, okay. Always a car, okay. It seems like a lot of people take trains, but... I don't know. I've never been to France. And I'm certainly not the best at speaking French. Also, one of my relatives' last name is Renault. So I definitely got a little bit of French in me. Yep. Like the car company. The one that's in bed with Nissan. Which French car do you like, or which French car company do you like the most? At distance, I'd have to say Citroen, but that's probably because I'm crazy. You're probably gonna end up just buying a Toyota. I can feel it. You're gonna be one of those kids who'll grow up and buy a Toyota. Five bucks says you're gonna buy a Toyota when you grow up. are Citroen, I think. Yes, the, or Renault. Uh, I can't remember. Let me double check. Oh, that's Renault as well. Okay. That makes more sense. Oh, Peugeot. Oh, ooh. Peugeot. That's a really... Those are some really big car companies.
Okay, that's everything done. Let's sell the paint and get on out of here. The ch oh. My condolences on the Nissan. I love how it took a random picture of the bathroom even though we did absolutely nothing in the bathroom. Mm. Yeah, now snails sound like a really slimy way to start your day. Okay, they want us to remove we Let's just Actually, you know what? This is also a weed be gone. Okay, that's supposed to be here, okay. Let's build this up. There we go, that was really easy. Man, what are we doing to this poor kid? We're literally giving him a cock. We're literally giving this poor kid a giant cock. Okay, that is a really bad joke. I'm sorry. But please tell me you at least got that joke. Let's just plant these. I'm probably annoying them, but like you can't have these out for so long. It's a really bad idea. But hey, it's a re really relaxing game, so. That's the best part, is I can just de-stress about it. 
Alright, there you go. And then there's one more weed somewhere. There we go. There we go. Mm -hmm. Think about it like this, you're sitting here, you can still reach this edge, but you still got all this other functional space you can use with it. See how you can use the sea in two different spots? It's a very different way of using it while also having, you know, it's a different flair, you know? I'd probably put a second table here if I wanted to do more. I'd love to play Stardew Valley. I'm just used to thinking like this because I don't have a large amount of living space so I have to make do with what I have and just accept what it is. Okay, hmm. what's the next one? Okay. Thank you. 
Okay, so this one. I know a lot of my friends are used to having really big rooms, but like you gotta work with what you have. Mm -hmm. That one's done. Don't mind the flowers that are randomly getting cut. I love how I'm doing this with all of the dial can see just running over with the lawnmower. Okay. Ah, oh, I can't get over there. Yeah, it's a little broken. Here it is. There we go. Remove weeds means anything that's unwanted. This can include partially dead flowers. A weed is a uh, refer for a crop or a plant that uh, basically takes up soil space and nutrients that you don't want. It's not the drug, it's just a slang that's used with the drug more than anything else. Corn moss. Mm. Uh, I'd love to swing it by the wall, but it's not gonna let me. But there, that's sure. Man, I'm getting hungry. It's nearly uh, three. Last day was a couple. So this is something I've noticed that Google Translate has been doing a lot. And that is, it'll start using offensive words as slang 
more frequently than actually the a technical term. For example, it will use the F bomb in a lot of situations uh, where the where you wouldn't actually use a direct translation for F bomb in most contexts, but because it's used more frequently as slang, the machine learning has overridden it and put that as normal. It's why you can't trust machine learning as much. To be fair, people swear a lot. But yeah. In general, with the way that a lot of things are going on politically, using the term weed in normal so the default social context makes people think of the word of the drug. Yeah. I don't know why. I always think Italians and French people swear the most. <laughs> Outside of the US, I should say. And British. The British people swear. Hmm. To be fair, at work, half my lines are expletive sometimes. <laughs> Like, oh, hey, they break, they effing broke this order again. Third time in a row. A lot of it's due to it being a stupidly high stress environment. I mean, in the U.S., you can't really get away with calling someone that. All right, let's try to get this one. That's not gonna fit back there. Yeah, this garden's a mess. I would change it up a lot if I had the money and the time. I want to get through as much of the career mode as I can, but the problem is to properly build a house takes a certain amount of time. Let's see how much money we have at the end of this mission, and then I might buy a property and do it, and then that'll be the stream for today. Then they want ribs. Okay. All right. Uh. Oh well. I'll see you when I'll see you tomorrow then. I hope Leo's alright. I haven't seen him in forever. Like, I see him once in a while, but it's much more rare. I think he's dealing with school stuff.
This job's really not paying that well. For the amount of work I put into this. Like, oh, hey, here's a grand. No. This is worth, like, five grand. Just remember to not disappear to apparently. I'm sorry, bad puns. We're getting a decent number of these missions out of the way though, so I'm happy with that. Dun 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 Alright, all tasks complete. Only two grand. Okay. That is a rip. That took so long because we had to plant all those plants. And we had to mow too. Alright. Alright, good night or whatever. Have a great day. This is definitely a case of why did you let these people rent this place out? The 
radiator theft and theft of good taste. more sense. Clean. Clean. Okay, let's clean it. Clean. This place is just savagely destroyed. to this room for the painting. No sing. Okay. I might actually stop earlier. But, uh, man, I'm so hungry. I'm just gonna probably stop and just. Yeah. No, I'm gonna stop. I'm too. I don't know, I got a cold or something. Yeah, I'm gonna stop for now. But thank you all for watching, and I hope you have a great day. See you guys soon.